so today's look is on this look right here. It's really simple to do. You can substitute the lip color for a nude color. You don't have to use the fake lashes. Just use your favorite mascara and double it up. Don't forget to subscribe to my channel if you'd like to view more of my videos. Thanks, guys. So the first thing I'm going to do is prime my eyes, of course, with Max Painterly Paint Pot. So I'm going to be using Tartlet Tees. So I'm going to go in with the color Whisper and I'm just going to place this all over my lid. So now that that's all over my lid, I'm going to go in with the color First Kiss and that's this beautiful color right here. I'm just going to be placing this into my crease. I'm only going to stop about halfway. I'm not going to go all the way in. And I'm also going a little bit above my crease. So now that that's done, I'm going to go in with the color Crush, and I'm just going to place this all over my lid. I'm going to go back in and I'm going to use the color Heartbreaker, which is this brown color right here. I'm just going to go in and shade this right into the outer V of my eyelid, just to give a little bit of depth. I'm focusing just on this outer corner. Okay, so now that that's done with, I'm going to go into my face and then we'll fix up the rest of my eyes after. So today I'm going to be using Matchbox Photo Finish Primer Water to prime my face. I'm going to go in with the Urban Decay Naked Skin One and Done Hybrid Complexion Perfector. I'm in the color Medium Light. So just dot this all over my face. And then I'm going to go in with this little Tarte Kabuki brush just to blend it out. I find that this blends a lot nicer if you don't use a sponge because it's such light coverage that if you did use a sponge, it will soak up all of the product. And that's not what we want. I'm going to go in with the Urban Decay Naked Skin Concealer. This I'm also in the color Medium Light. This I will be using a sponge just to blend out. So wherever I see a little bit of redness peeking through, I'm just putting a little bit extra concealer because the Perfector wasn't quite full coverage, which we knew going into it. So that's all right, but I just like to cover up a little bit extra of the redness. If you're not too keen into spending money on a beauty blender, Definitely spend money on the Real Technique sponge because it works exactly the same. I'm going to go in and set my under eyes using, of course, the Kat Von D Shade and Light Palette. So I'm just using the banana shade for my under eyes. I'm going to go in and fill in my eyebrows. So I'm just going to be using the Anastasia Beverly Hills Brow Definer. I'm in the color Dark Brown. Then I just spool it out. Once that's done, I go in and take the edge of the Real Technique sponge and I just kind of carve out right on top where I may have made a mistake. 
I just go in with the middle contour shade in the palette. Once I'm all burns up, I like to go in and contour. So I just like to use this It Cosmetics contouring brush. And I go in with this shade and I mix it with this shade. And then I like to go down the bridge of my nose. And then once that's done, I go in with blush. So I'm using this Bare Minerals Ready Blush in the color Natural High. And it just looks like this. And once my blush is applied, we can go in and I like to apply my highlight, it, the Gleam Glow Kit by Anastasia Beverly Hills. And I'm going to go in with the color Crushed Pearl. So now that that's applied, I go in and I do my usual and I carve up my contour with Laura Mercier's translucent powder. So I'm gonna go in and let that bake while I do the rest of my makeup. So now that the majority of my makeup is done, I'm just gonna go in and lightly curl my lashes for fake lashes. So once this eyelash is on, I just go in with the other one and I put on the glue and I let it get tacky. I just plop it on. I'm just going with the Benefit Cosmetics Roller Lash just to combine my lashes. So now that that's combined, I like to go in and do my bottom lashes. But first I just want to make sure that my eyebrows are set, so I just go in with the Anastasia brow Clear Brow Gel. And then a brow highlight, I like to just go in and take a color. Color in the Naked palette that I really like. So I just use the color Virgin. I just highlight my brow bone. And then I also use this color and I will go in and highlight my inner corner. And use Max Extended Play Giggle Lash. I go in with the 24-7 Waterline Walk of Shame on my waterline. This is just to brighten my eyes. I really want my eyes to look open, so I'm going to go in with a lot of this. For lip color, I'm going in with the NYX 831 Mauve Lip Pencil. So 
So I'm going with the color Bikini by Tarte. 